guys. <laughs> First full day in Paris. We got here last night. Lots of travels. Got croissant. Meant to get an almond croissant, but they did not want to give it to me. <laughs> That's okay. We're just stupid Americans. <laughs> we're eating really quick and then we're getting on the train to go to Versailles. So exciting. Okay. It's just gorgeous. Cannot believe in Paris. Croissant is delicious though. We got in yesterday at like what? Five? Five. Yeah. Before that, we flew from New York to London and then London to Paris. And then last night we had a really cute like little dinner. And then this place does not like me. <laughs> then we're at our hotel and then we're in Paris for three nights. Then we're going to Lisbon and then we're going back to London, back to New York. I think this will just be a vlog of all of it. <laughs> bikes for inside the garden we just found out that you can't ride the bikes inside mm -hmm. the gates of the garden so then there's these golf carts mm -hmm. so fun 42 euros an hour we're gonna ride around on the golf cart he asked for a driver's license to give him and you have to be 24 to drive i was like we should have brought our fake ids yeah. feeling just, defeated it's yeah just really we're just on the foot it's wet and it's kind of cold but it's pretty probably won't see much of it but <laughs> Ooh. In the Grand Canal. That was something I saw you could do too. Probably have to be like 30. The gardens were giving like this part of the gardens giving forest. Yeah. It's not giving Bridgerton. Like we No. Talking. Also, like the big part of it right by the palace is all torn up in just dirt because I guess they're redoing it for the summer. For the Olympics. Probably for the Olympics, yeah. We're coming up to a break in the forest. Oh. I think it's a Saturn fountain. See if I'm right. Every time we see a golf cart, we're just jealous. They're just like someone it just drove right past us. Looked like they were having fun. Okay, now we're at, we were just in a part that was really. Oh, that's pretty. Look at all those golf carts. Ugh, that's that could have been us. We looked it up. You have to be 21 to rent a car in France, but not to rent a golf cart. Okay, this part's pretty. We may hear a water show. Oh, it's giving that. You're splashing. Uh, yeah, that's water show. We were gonna get closer to the water show, but it's kind of windy getting splashed. I wonder if they had water shows back then. Where to next? I don't know, we see now the mirror pool and the Saturn fountain. Oh, we should go through the King's Garden right here and then get to the exit. I think we're catching the finale. <laughs> oh. oh, wait, these are pretty. Uh, this is what I wanted to see, like flowers. I know, this is the first flower we've seen. We're in the last of it, but we're gonna go try to rent our bikes. bike we stopped because we kind of came to a dead end slash we think we need to turn back because we only have the bikes for an hour but we're doing a little photo shoot <laughs> on the bike <laughs> oh, 
follow us on Instagram to see the results. <laughs> Okay, we finished our bike ride and we actually have to go all the way through the gardens again. I got coffee. They only had dairy milk, which I don't like. And she told me it was dairy by mooing at me. But we're gonna walk through the gardens again. And I just spilled it everywhere. Lord got me napkin. <laughs> we're about to leave. We took pictures for a while in these gardens, like with the palace in the back. We got them left, but the sky was like completely gray. Then we got to like this point and turned around, completely blue skies. So we went back into the better pictures, the better <laughs> sky. And now we're gonna try to find a great place. <laughs> We're at our cute little hotel, got back from Versailles, took the train. I took a little 30 minute nap. We've been kind of researching when we want to do what for the rest of our two days. And we decided tonight we're going to go walk over. It's like 5 p.m., almost 5 p.m. right now. We're going to walk over to this little cocktail bar that also has a lot of shops around it. Go eat dinner over there. And then we're going to a little river cruise tonight where it takes you around at night to a bunch of different monuments, including the Eiffel Tower from the view of like the water. And that is at 9. And then the sun sets at 9.30. So hopefully we'll be on it or we will be on it like when the sun is setting and everything. Um, Changed outfits. I have this little long white skirt on, a white tank, and then this blazer. I did like a video of all my outfits on the trip that is probably posted by now. We were actually not leaving yet because I tried to get my purse out of the safe and there's like an error and the code won't work. But I know I put the right code because then when I put the wrong, yeah. a wrong code, it's a different error. And now it seems like it's dead. It won't even light up. So we anymore. called someone and he like tried to put in like the special code and it's not working. And he just said, I'll be right back. <laughs> so we'll see. We think that's what he said. <laughs> Can't understand. <laughs> yeah. It's been like 30 minutes though. So we're just vibing, waiting. Update, safe's battery is broken, but we got our stuff. And now we're gonna, now we're gonna go to dinner. <laughs> he was so nice though. He felt really bad. Okay, basically we had metro tickets, but at the station that we got on at, the gates were broken so we went in without scanning our ticket. And there you have to scan it when you go in and out. So when we got to our destination, there were police at the scan outs and they were checking our tickets and they saw that we didn't get scanned in. So they pulled us to the side. And we were trying to tell him that the station that we got on at was broken. But one, we like didn't really know the name of it. Then we finally figured it out. We had to call the station to confirm. I like totally understand that he thought we were trying to get on for free, but we were like, you can keep the ticket. We aren't trying to use it again. And he eventually gave us a ticket back with a trip still on it and let us go. So we basically rode the train for free. But overall, it was actually just a fine experience. Like I wasn't nervous at all because I knew we hadn't really done anything wrong. They were very nice and not intimidating. The only issue was that we were like already in a rush and then unfortunately we were now late to our river cruise and a bit frazzled. <laughs> Oh, I'm departing in a minute. We were supposed to be here two, three minutes ago. So we almost got arrested. That's not our fault. Look at the Eiffel Tower. Yeah, that's it. Oh, that? Right, that. That's it. Okay. Ooh, sit, like. Good 
morning vlog. Morning. <laughs> we just got pastry. I got coffee. And we're walking to the loo. We have a tour at 10.15. And we're just like right down the street from our hotel. So nice. Yeah, we're doing two museums today. We really want to find these like vintage photo booths. Yeah. And then, uh, no thank you. And then, um, Oh, I'm vlogging you guys. It's like something else. We're gonna go see the Mona Lisa. Crazy. Ah. Just told us Leonardo da Vinci has 14 paintings and five of them are here. in Paris we leave this afternoon for Lisbon so we're doing the final things on our list we're taking pictures of the Eiffel Tower going to this cute little restaurant and then we're gonna go to the Musée d'Orsay before our flight but we're about to I think this is the street we're about to turn on the street oh my god that like is supposed to have a really good view okay. we go down a little bit but <laughs> we see the tip of it but it's like almost eight o'clock and the streets are empty like people do not Get up here. Are you kidding me? We're like the only ones here. It almost feels it's like too good to be sure. We're in Paris. I just took amazing photos of all good Instagram. Uh we're on Rude University. It's like University Street, but such a sleigh, this is crazy. I'm propped up like on the street sign. <laughs> We're just way better vertical. The um, only influencer that's Octo Buddy. <laughs> yeah, I know. I, I literally have one back at the hotel and I keep being like, wish I would have bought my Octo Buddy. It's got amazing content. Just made a Blair and Serena TikTok. Our junior year of college, we went to my Halloween date event together as Blair and Serena. Mm -hmm. So, full circle. So fitting. But we're going to go to breakfast, I guess. I just don't want to leave. So I know. it's gorgeous. Uh, you know, like, still isn't that many people here. And I said last week, it's so nice. It's Empty. like the most perfect it could have been. I love it. Perfect. Okay, back in the hotel. It's almost 11. So we're going to quickly pack up our bags, give them to the front desk, and then we're going to go to the Musée d'Orsay and just kind of do that until we have to leave for the airport at like 2. Yeah. 1.30. Okay, just got into the Musée d'Orsay. We have like an hour and a half. We actually bought tickets like super last minute last night and we're so glad we did because the line was so long if you don't have a ticket. We like paid probably double the price, but yeah. it was still like $30 and it's worth it to skip the line. Uh -huh. um, but yeah, we're just gonna frolic. <laughs>
made it to Lisbon. We're going to Lisbon. I don't know if I told you. I'm here for the Taylor Swift concert, which is tomorrow night. Tonight's night one. But I'm gonna do a separate Taylor Swift vlog because we still have fun things to do in Lisbon, and then I just want the Taylor Swift vlog to be its own vlog. We got a baguette on our last few hours in Paris and cheese, and brought it to the airport. And we're sitting outside at the pool, and it's so nice. But we're gonna kind of plan some things and probably we'll eat dinner around here. We're kind of far from the city, but we're close to the stadium. So, oh, and then tonight we're also gonna walk to the stadium when it gets closer to when the surprise songs will be and listen to those. We don't know which kind of cheese this is because- I didn't read it. We also yeah. thought it was only $3 and then it was $3 a pound. Yeah, so it was nine. Oh, it literally says nine euros on this. <laughs> that still so isn't that's still horrible, but- It's awful, though. I think you guys it's been it's sitting, been out. sitting in the- we had two options for bread, white or traditional. I don't know if we got, we got white, but I don't know what my answer was. Mm. Whose son feels nice? I know. We basically tried everything we wanted to in, in Paris. We didn't find the other photo booth, but all the food, I feel like we hit all the must. <laughs> we're like bundled up basically we decided we're like 30 minutes drive from the city where there's like a lot of restaurants so we're gonna go tomorrow but we're gonna uber to a mcdonald's we are that's 0.3 miles away but the walk is like 16 minutes and the uber is five euros so we're ubering gonna do a little portugal mcdonald's mook thing <laughs> and then we're gonna walk to the stadium and make it to surprise songs and maybe buy some merch hopefully buy some merch hopefully buy some merch so, it's cold we need a sweatshirt it is really cold that's why we're like kind of weirdly bundled up because we didn't really pack for the cold okay, so we ubered here we got dropped off and he's like i can't drop you off like in front of it and we're like okay and we're walking around we i was like is it in a mall like what's it in it's in the zoo and the zoo is open till 10. I guess it's free because we just walked into the zoo. So we're now experiencing the Lisbon Zoo. Which direction is the McDonald's, the food court? Oh, here. It says over here. McDonald's Jardin Zula. Yeah. This sounds like a sentence I would say in my Spanish class. Yeah, literally we're going to McDonald's in the zoo. It's kind of fun. What kind of animals do you Ooh, here is a... Monkeys. Loki, like, couldn't he get out of this? Yeah, this is very secure. I can hear him. We were joking. Monkeys or something. <laughs> okay, this is all that we're ordering. Here's the vibes. Okay, we got snack wrap. There's, there were two types of chicken. So we got chicken, two chicken light, classic McNugget. What was this? Yo. Yo. Chicken bacon, officer, chicken bacon, onion. Not really sure. Then mayonnaise and mustard sauce. And potato sauce. And then we got fries. And I've never had a normal snack wrap, so I don't even know what to compare it. We got the chicken and mayo. There's also a chicken and cheese. They used to have like a ranch one. This looks like it has no mayo ranch in it. Exist in Loki, I feel like I'm gonna love this. I'm nervous. Do you like mayo? I like don't love mayo. I but love I mayo. Oh wow, that surprises me. It just feels like a lot it of tortilla. Like something that would gross you out. <laughs> mm. I have onions in it. That's good. Mm -hmm. I like that. It has a lot of onions, so that's what makes it good. I can't tell where the onions are though. Like, if I lived here, I would eat this often. The chicken's good. Mm -hmm. Really crispy. Mm -hmm. I usually don't like sauces like this. <laughs> Mayonnaise mayo and mustard. mustard. Mm -hmm. That's oh, what's it? Mayo and garlic. That's I like that. Well, it's really it's like garlic. an aioli. What does that taste like? It does taste chai -y. It's good. I almost like can't look at it though. It looks all fun. Do you like what you like mayonnaise? <laughs> <laughs> looks like mayonnaise. Yeah, but I didn't know what mayonnaise is. I don't know what that is. It's probably mayonnaise. <laughs> chicken slides. <laughs> What's like the chicken in there? I think it is. It's like every other fast food chicken mm -hmm. I get. And the classic. They look the same. They don't taste the same. Really? Uh, I mean, it's, I think it's been a while. Yeah, I don't have them enough to know. The crisp, the outside doesn't seem the same to me. Not for the finale. CBO service. <laughs> onion bun or bacon and cheese yeah. bun. It has crispy onions in it, bacon, 
<laughs> a chicken patty. They could have this in the U.S. and I wouldn't know because I'm yeah. not like a... I can't look at it. That's how I thought about the wrap. We were all over that. It tastes like the Subway Soup Munch I get. Yeah. It's nothing special. I don't really like it. I don't like it. Basically, it's that, but that's so much better. I told you. <laughs> this is no for me. The chicken doesn't look good either. Which is weird, you think we have a lot of chicken on our plate and the rest of the chicken's good. It's true. The McFlurries are gonna redeem themselves eh, for us. I they look good. It. They do look really good. I'm curious about the spoon situation. I think they're just stick. Maybe oh, they're- no. Oh no, they're- Okay, this is the Oreo. Looks normal. And what's in the Kit Kat? It's just crush Kit Kat. Yeah, your ice cream. Uh-huh. Clearly I don't eat McDonald's enough because I don't know what this is supposed to taste like. The Kit Kat doesn't really have any flavor, it's just crunch to me. Mm -hmm. Like it doesn't overpower them. I don't really think this has any flavor either. The ice cream's good though. It is good. Average. Oh my gosh, okay, if we just got dropped off for my Uber, we can hear it. <laughs> This still doesn't feel real. We just saw two girls walk by with a merch bag too. Perfect. Sounds like she's in folk more. So we still have some time. No, we can hear it so well. This is crazy. Oh, there's all the merch. We slept in a little bit. We were supposed to be out of here 30 minutes ago, but we're going downtown. These are so cheap here, five euros. And 
We're gonna go to the pastry, get breakfast, kind of walk around, shop around, and then we're gonna come back and get ready for our concert. But it's really nice outside, and I'm happy it's not cold yeah. and cloudy. I'm wearing this like set that I got at Kidzera Sara. But we're at this restaurant called Ponto Final. It's on the water, right across from the bridge. We've been waiting in line for almost an hour. They just started letting people in reservations book up super far in advance. They're booked up all throughout summer, but they do have tables for walk-ins. So you just have to wait in line starting at six. And then the restaurant opens at seven. So we got here at 6.30 and I think we'll get the second seating. So like once people are done, we'll get that. So I'm probably gonna get some wine and it'll honestly be good because I think then we'll have dinner during the sunset. So. I've had anchovies. Yeah. I've never tried a whole anchovy. Though. Like, I've tried, it, it's obviously in Caesar dressing. Yeah. It's and then we cold. ordered, like, is it cold? That's the dish was yes. cold. Oh. oh, okay. The sauce is good. Like and I love tiny. onions. So I know, me too. So, this onions. is good. So, do sardines have bones? They must, right? Okay. Yeah. They do? I think so. You supposed to eat it with a knife and fork? I bet. This is the time to try a sardine. Mm -hmm. it's it's not not bad. Yeah, it's not like a strong fish taste at all. I don't like that it's cold, I would say. Yeah. It's good. I can't tell the anatomy of it. Wow. Um, the skin's also are you supposed to eat? I guess you eat the skin. I can just taste the I can yeah. just taste the sauce. Yeah, they're it's definitely salty. It's not my favorite. Mm -hmm. But it's not bad. But it's like, like I don't really want to keep eating it. No, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so it's not even. Guys, our waiter just came back and took the. He was like, "Are you finished with the sardines?" And we we're like, "Yeah." He's like, "You didn't like them." <laughs> <laughs> 
for like no we just wanted to try sardines he was like well you shouldn't have tried these i was like what <laughs> stew is here this is not that was so we just got to the ferry it's definitely not in operation <laughs> oops yeah i thought i looked it up but i know it was in portuguese but the again the ubers are so cheap it's a to 12 euros all the way back to our hotel. Yeah. That's, that's crazy. Like a 30 minute Uber. Great. <laughs> there was a water taxi that was charging 10 euros. Just gonna cross and then we would have to take another taxi. And it would have been freezing. It's a little yeah. cold. Oh my god, the boat would have been so Yeah. Cold. False alarm. We did not miss our ferry. <laughs> we are intelligent women who know what they're doing with public transit. But we are still Ubering. We're choosing to Uber. Because we get back to the city and then we still have like basically a 30 minute Uber. So we might as well just Uber from here, especially if it's 12 euros. So, but we did not miss our ferry. Just want to make that clear. Okay, ranking for what we tried. Strawberries are at the top. Yeah, I agree. Um, I would say sandwich. Agreed. Gyoza, gyoza, the fries, and then the cider. Okay. I think I would go fries, gyoza, then cider. So I feel like the gyoza was really good, but I've had good gyoza. Right. It's, it's like not that hard to make it. The fries were different. Yeah, I never had anything like them. They were so yummy. Just chocolate. Just I know. Maybe we could have gotten two. Oh, no. <laughs> we're going to have to come back. Now I'm obsessed. That went down too fast. Yeah. <laughs> the cutest little spot, Notting Hill. Yes. True. Let's do a haul. Yes. We just shopped around for a while. I don't even know how long <laughs> we've been here, but they have a ton of like little boutiques and stores. We tried on like absolutely everything i really you show what you got first this is why we came it's so I cute it's a jacket it's so There's cute so, it's so cute so basically we went to a bunch of stores that had a ton it's called the blue door but there's like probably like three that kind yeah. of sell different ones and they have so many products like in these patterns it's giving beer bradley they also had like these three little bags that i loved but i couldn't find one that i loved enough and i also didn't let myself try on enough jackets because i don't need more jackets i'm <laughs> running out of hangers i did get a little heart cashmere scarf and we got five dollars off yeah. Them. But then I went next door. So this is originally 20 and then I asked for 15. Then I went next door and, and they were literally selling it for 15. So I also got a watch. I've been wanting Oh, I forgot. We're not sure if it works or not, but that's really cute. We had like a whole table of watches. We also found PJs in like those patterns, but only one store had shorts. And I'm not sure if I'm sold on the pattern, but yeah, we'll keep you updated if we decide to go back. But we just took cute pics at this color, these colored streets. We also took the bus here. That was fun. And I did fall asleep. Any moving vehicle, I like start to fall asleep. We moved you. <laughs> Any time I see your post, I'm like, I can't. We're yeah, no, I know. Bus. Like, it's only one at a time. <laughs> <laughs> I've always wanted to try these. I don't know what's what. I don't know either. It smells like chocolate to me. That's pretty good. It tastes like a gummy. Like a. Mine's raspberry. True's rose. It tastes like raspberry too. I think that third one's the raspberry one, but maybe not. Let's try the third. That's the rose one. This one? I love rose. Too, so. You know what I go? I don't mind it. I like the raspberry better. Guys, I just 
just got a blowout in Harrods, which is like the most insane department store I've ever been in. He's taking me like this weird, funky part. I think I'm gonna leave it till I can get to a brush. I could have asked for a middle part. It does kind of fall to this side, I guess. I don't know, but I really didn't feel like washing my hair in the hotel tonight, so this is perfect. saw Tom Holland with her own eyes. He was so, hot. so good in it. Like yeah. so good. We got a lot of the McDonald's things that we oh wanted in Lisbon. This is the oh, it's big. Caesar bacon crispy. Wrap. And then this is the chili crispy wrap. And we also got mozzarellas. Oh yeah. Okay. Like okay. okay. They didn't give us our dessert. Are you kidding me? Neither of them. Are you kidding? Why didn't we check? We totally should have checked. They have the fried pies and we got a raspberry chocolate one and an apple one. I was just so, they, their system was so good, I trusted them. If we're feeling like we can walk back later, I really wanted the fried pie. We had to go the whole. We're open until 2.45 a.m. So. The mozzarella bites. And there's also this rich tomato sauce that I really want. I think it's like marinara. Like cool. is really sweet. Mm -hmm. On the subway, we kept seeing ads for the wrap of the day. <laughs> What's, what is it? Wednesday, Wednesday, Friday, Sunday, or something random. And it's the chili crispy chicken wrap. All these wraps are like. Okay. Looks like there's mayo in it. Like arugula. I doubted it last time though in Lisbon, and then I ended up liking it. So. I feel like I didn't get the flavor. Yeah, I had to like take a weird bite to try and get. Yeah, that's probably a good bite. Oh, no, we can take it. She was gripping on. I was like, oh, sorry. I didn't know if you thought I was handing it over to you and you weren't ready. It was fine. When you don't get a bite with the sauce, it just kind of tastes it's just like nothing. chicken and tortilla. Caesar bacon. I did forget that last time the bacon scared me. It was yeah, just rip it off. Man handling the arm wrap. Oh no. <laughs> the, is the Caesar sweet? It doesn't taste. It doesn't taste like Caesar. That's for sure. I think I like the sweet chili, but still none of as good as the U.S. wrap. The Lisbon one had this chicken. A vegan. The fries are also very soggy, which is surprising because they looked fresh. Winner is definitely the moth bites. <laughs>